In this video, we'll look at the Infinity Quiz module. So the Infinity Quiz module offers 1,500 quiz questions, 500 for each of the three specifications that you can see at the moment. You can then filter the question bank further by topic. And also we've got a special mode, targeted training mode. If a student struggles with a particular question, they can expect more questions from that topic until they get three right in a row. So when the Infinity Quiz starts, it will randomly select questions from the question bank that are relevant to the filters that have been set up. And this process will repeat over and over again until the quiz is manually stopped by the user. Even when a question bank gets exhausted, it will be replenished so this quiz can go on infinitely. Hence the name. In the teacher dashboard, teachers can create infinity challenges after giving the challenge a name, a number of questions to be answered, and any other details, for example, what specification, different topics, then you can set your start time and your end time. And what the system will do is it will start recording every answer that is relevant to the challenge that students in that group make between the start and the end time. So if a student goes to the Infinity Quiz now, they will be shown that they are carrying out a challenge. And on the right hand side, they can see how they're progressing through that challenge where the remaining questions reduces down to zero. As soon as that's done, they can carry on the quiz or they could finish the quiz. And if the teacher goes to their teacher dashboard, goes to the Infinity Quiz challenges, they will be able to see a leaderboard which will show the progress of their students against that particular challenge. This can work really well as an engaging weekly class competition. So join me in the next video where we'll have a look at the Pi Puzzles module.